Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie Bree and today I'm talking about my beef with black and white cinema. Now I'm not going to talk about TV because you know, TV is a separate thing. I studied film in college. You know, I was a film major. I wanted to be, I went to film school. I wanted to make, become a filmmaker. So that was my, where my focus was. I studied film history because I love cinema. I love films. I love movies. I watch movies all day long. I'm not going to go so far as to say I don't give a shit about TV. It's just... For me, it's movies first. TV is just like, okay, if it's, you know, if it's okay, great. If not, I don't care. I want to watch movies. So, what's my problem with black and white movies? So, I don't have a problem with a movie being black and white for the sake of being black and white or just because it's black and white. So, example, Clerks. Clerks was made in 1994, I believe, and it's black and white. Now, it was an artistic choice, but it was also a budgetary choice. It was the only film he could afford. He was literally, like, making a movie on a $50,000 budget. He was maxing out his credit cards and borrowing from his friends to make this movie. He had to keep it as low fucking budget as possible. I can still watch Clerks. I don't watch it and go, geez, I wish this was in color. I watch it and I appreciate it. I just enjoy it. It's a good movie. But there are black and white movies I can't watch. Like, for example, Dracula, the original from 19-whatever. But it's not because it's in black and white I can't watch it. Now, I am an artist. And I, I, when I say artist, I don't just mean content creator. I'm a musician. I create music. But also, I'm a painter. I paint. I, you know, studied art in college and in high school. I, I took art classes every year of high school and every year of college. Um, it was one of my, you know, electives. I always took art, so I have an, an affinity for art, an appreciation for art. And I, one of the things I love about art is the colors. I love colors. I love things that are colorful. Black and white has no fucking color. But that's not my problem with it. And here's where it gets messy, and I'm going to wrap this up real quick because I have already talked about this in other videos. But here's my thing. I, I, it's hard to explain. I watch a lot of horror movies, like a fucking lot of horror movies. But I do not watch true crime. I do not watch the news. I do not watch documentaries. I do not watch crime dramas. I do not watch police procedurals. I do not watch murder mysteries or detective stories or anything like that. And I don't fucking do true crime, unsolved mysteries or anything like that. None of it. Nothing like that. I do not handle real life death very well. I can handle the movies okay because I know it's just fucking make believe. It's fairy tale. That being said, when a movie or a TV show or anything has a certain number of people in it that are dead in the main cast, I can't watch it anymore because I'm watching a bunch of fucking ghosts. I cannot watch I Love Lucy because it's all goddamn ghosts. They're all fucking dead. They're, none of them are, are, are people anymore. They're just fucking memories. And I can't do that. It Psychologically, I cannot watch a movie or a TV show where I know everybody's fucking dead. I can't do it. I'm not at that point with Star Wars A New Hope yet, but I'm getting close to it. There's a lot of ghosts in Star Wars, and pretty soon I will get to the point where I can no longer watch A New Hope. And I know some people say that's bullshit, whatever. It is my thing. It is me. It's just it's just my thing. So that's the real reason I can't watch black and white movies, because most black and white movies are so old, most of their cast are dead. Or at least the starring cast. You know, there might be a few, like, 80, 90, 100 year old, you know, extras or actors or, you know, like supporting cast from those movies. But by and large, the stars of those movies are ghosts. And I am. You watch my horror movie reviews, I'm terrified of ghosts. I'm fucking. I, haunted house movies are the scariest fucking movies I've ever seen. The scariest movie to me is Poltergeist followed by The Conjuring, and I go back and forth on which one's actually scarier, I do not handle ghosts very well. So that is that is where I stand on black and white movies. 
or just old movies in general.